Good day. Welcome to the Procon YouTube channel. My name is Johan Duplessis. This is the second part of the mesh refinement series. This video will discuss the defeaturing of slabs. We will look at an example slab with complicated details and I will show you how to defeature it in order to have a simpler analysis with a better quality mesh and no triangular shell elements. I have prepared a 10 by 10 meter slab. You will see that there are various indentations in the slab that might be related to architectural features. These small indentations complicate the mesh needed to discretize the slab. Clicking on the mesh command, the mesh does not look terrible, however the triangular elements used at the corners of the slab can be avoided if we defeature the slab a little bit. To compare the mesh of the newly generated slab and the original slab, I will make a copy of this slab and defeature the copy. I will now remove all the indentations to make sure that it's a simple 10 by 10 square slab. You will see that the newly created slab has a much better mesh pattern and the reduction in the number of nodes used will reduce the analysis time required. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. For more tips and tricks, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.